Welcome to JasonNewland.com My name is Jason Newland This is Relaxation Hypnosis for Stress, Anxiety and Panic Attacks Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes so this is going to be a relaxation technique. It's going to be a fairly short recording. It's something that you can just do when you're on your own. And when you can... just You need a little bit of space, a little bit of time to do it. But not a lot of time. So all I'm going to ask you to do is sit in a comfortable chair. One that supports your body. Although this is not sleep. Make sure that in the event of you falling asleep, the chair will support your body. So you don't fall on the floor. This is a short technique to help you to reduce your anxiety levels. And I want you to just get an idea of, for yourself, what level, what number would you put it on the scale of 1 to 10 10 being the most anxious that you could feel 1 being like the lowest the least, the lowest um, what number would you give it now as you think about it as you focus on your body your mind, attention you know just kind of how you're feeling and I realised that it may actually and it sounds weird but may actually have reduced just by pressing the play button on this recording which is kind of natural it's fine and also hearing my voice if you're used to hearing my voice the more often you listen to me the quicker you become relaxed it just seems to be part of the process. Now if you just notice what number it is now. On a scale of 1 to 10. What I'm going to ask you to do is. I want you to imagine you've got a balloon. But it's just a, an empty balloon. You know, fresh out of the packet. And in your mind, I want you to imagine you're pumping that balloon up. Okay, so it's an empty balloon, but you've put it onto a, the end of the nozzle of a, a pumping machine. I suppose like a bicycle pump or whatever the equivalent is for pumping up balloons. And just pump it up. And every time you push that air in, what you're pushing into it is the anxiety. You're pushing the anxiety from your body and from your mind into that balloon. And a balloon can be any colour you want. Or it can be no colour. It doesn't matter. It can be any shape that you want. And just keep pumping that anxiety into the balloon and as you do that notice how your body feels different as you pump again more of the anxiety into that balloon and the balloon starts to get bigger and just let you know if you're not a big fan of balloons uh, or if you have any fear of balloons popping this will not pop okay 
It's not going to happen. It's just going to get full of this anxiety. Just notice how your body feels. The more of that anxiety that you pump into that balloon. Notice how your mind feels as you keep pumping that anxiety in. And notice how the balloon gets bigger and bigger and bigger. And you keep doing it until the point where you feel your body and your mind is really relaxed. And the thing that's pumping the balloon up, when you take it, a balloon off the end, it automatically uh, makes a knot at the bottom of the balloon. So the balloon doesn't deflate and it can't pop either, okay? It can't burst. It's just staying big and inflated. And you realize that actually that anxiety is almost like helium to the balloon because it wants to float up. It's not just a normal air. That anxiety is wanting to rise. It's almost like your body and your mind wasn't enough for the anxiety. It wanted to spread. It wants to spread its wings. It wants to get away from you. It wants to float away. Which it now can. Because in your mind, go outside. Into the garden or into the street in your mind. Just outside so you can see the sky. And just let go of that balloon. And watch it rise up into the sky. As you realize that that anxiety never wanted to hurt you, never wanted to cause you discomfort, it wanted to be released. It was basically banging against the door and the walls of you trying to get out but it couldn't and now you've released it and it can just float and continue to float up into the sky continue to float and as you try and try and follow with your eyes you can kind of make it out, but it starts to just become so tiny in the distance. It seems to just disappear. Gone, gone, far away. And now notice how your body and mind feels and notice what number you are on that scale that you had before notice how different you feel and you can repeat this process as many times as you choose and it literally takes a couple of minutes only takes a couple of minutes to achieve and that's the end of this recording so please remember to be kind to yourself because you deserve to be happy lots of love